Wish I could just jump across the water here. What happens if I go to the castle? No, not the memo file. I don't want to go to the memo. We gotta see if we can find Leon, right? So I don't know if we need to go into the castle at first, or if we can. I can't even go into the castle. Gotcha. I'm about to run out of magic with Maria, so maybe we'll just... Maybe I'll pop her into the front row and put the other two back to encourage her being able to be hit. And this will also give us the opportunity to save my healing spells. Gus is going to need one soon, but this isn't so bad. Or maybe I'll switch from the staff back to the bow for her. Doesn't seem like a bad idea. Especially given that I don't see any difference using the staff versus using the bow. Doesn't seem like the staffs have an actual magic attribute on them. At least not when I can see. Wasn't quite enough to kill it, but you apparently scared it off, so we'll we'll take that. Six gil. Now, if I discovered that I can't use magic unless I'm using the staff, that would be a, that would be something different. But it looks like we're fine. Still not doing enough to kill a hornet. Furion. Here we go. Probably gonna have to do three or four fights before Maria takes it upon herself to improve. But we're getting lots of Hornet fights to work on here. I think I'm gonna move Mar Maria into the front row because she doesn't. I'm not sure if that's why she's not being targeted, but it feels like that's what's happening. I don't expect that'll help her aim much, but. Form of Tentamon. Not right. Hornets. Wait. We're actually going to cure Gus here. I know we're about to be back in town, but I, I'll, I also still want to work on her magic abilities. Doing it in combat seems like the better choice. Boop, 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 boop. Maria's spirit increased. Yes. I don't know if spirit is going to make it so that I can heal more. We don't really need to worry about that at the moment, but I just want to do one more fight and see if we can get one or two more fights, maybe, and see if we can get Maria's... Cause what, are, what are we at? 78 with the staff, 46 with the bow. Eh, it's probably going to be a bit. <laughs> I 
I wonder if there's a method to this madness. Uh, I'm something in my head that popped up. I can equip multiple weapons. What if I? Oh, I can't equip the staff and the bow. Okay, the b there's still some sense here. I was. You 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 understand my logic or my my thought process? I saw that I could dual wield. Like, what if I had a bow and a staff? I can just slowly increase both of them at the same time. Again, I don't, I don't, I don't. <laughs> uh, where was, the prince was in Altair, right? Yeah. So we're not quite back. There'll be a few more fights in us before we get there. Do, 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 do. Goblins, attack! Jesus, that's overkill. And that's underkill, Maria. Can I attack my own party in order to increase my skills? <laughs> Probably not. She finally killed a goblin all by herself. I think it has to be the minuscule amount of damage she's able to output that causes this to take forever. Attack! Attack the goblins. Oh, she's able to... Wait, they have six health? I thought they only had five. Oh, no. She's going to need more. More power to the forward engines. There we go. She's killing goblins all by her lonesome now. And she did take one point of damage. One. That's it. <sighs> Yo, you. Oh, wait. I need item. Ring. Uh, that ring belonged to Scott. So, he said I should regain my... Thank you, brave ones. Now what? Come back here and see what the you have to say oh okay the password is wild rose yes I know what if I show you the ring that ring it is Scott's is he alive Prince Scott was in the town of Finn but after he handed his ring to us he so he gave you that ring before he died. Did he say anything? No, your highness. He left no other words. Your highness, please take this ring. No, it should remain with you, brave ones. Why? So you managed to infiltrate Finn and return safely. I underestimated you. Perhaps you can help us. We need someone to find Mithril, the enchanted metal. Where would we find that? Please help us. We need the mightiest 
possible warriors to retrieve the mystical metal mithril. Okay. I'm glad you didn't give me in, in red text the first time. If I hadn't went back, that would have been bad. Because I would have been running around going, where do I find Mithril? And nobody would have been able to help me with that. But now that I have it as a keyword... To keep in mind, if somebody gives me a green word, I should talk to them again to see if I can memorize the green word as a red word. Ask about Mithril. Apparently not. What about the king? Is the king in here? Yes. Oh, we can't talk to you anymore. Who else was in this castle? Nobody else we can talk to that is important. I assume I will talk to Tibble or whatever his name was. The master blacksmith. Tobal. Close. Mithril. If only we had Mithril to forge weapons and armor. What about the ring? Is the ring made of Mithril? No. Who told me about the boat? That's the thing that bothers me. I remember someone telling me about the canoe, but I can't seem to fucking find them now. It had to have been someone in here, right? One of the guards? I'm not crazy, am I? Somebody mentioned the canoe in this game. I remember seeing green text that said canoe. I'm going mad. is where the rebels are. Ah, it's you. To the east of here is the port town of Palum. You can't cross the lake without a canoe. So we can't, we've talked to that person multiple times and we don't get a keyword, so we can't ask about canoes. What about, what about you? Scott wielded a mithril sword, which was the treasure of Cassian. It was a truly magnificent sword. I don't... I don't think I'm going to be able to get back in there and get a sword. I don't recall seeing a sword hit the ground. Maria has so much magic points now. It's wonderful. She can use 17 spells. Just think of how vastly different this is. At the same point, an hour in, on the... Ugh. At an hour in in Final Fantasy 1, I, I had three spell slots for both my white mage and my black mage. I could, if I wanted to right now, equip the white mage and black mage spells with all three of my characters and they could all be using spells and have more combined magic ability than my white mage and black mage did for a very good while in Final Fantasy 1. I feel a little bit bad about that. Not too bad, but a little bad. Ba -ba -ba -ba. 
I'm gonna focus on the bow until we level it up. And then I think I'll switch back to the staff and get that leveled up and maybe kinda go back and forth. Preemptive strike. Also remembering that I need to be doing a oh, good job. I need to be doing words. They're hard. Magic in order to keep increasing my magic potency. Got two preemptive strikes in a row. That feels pretty nice. Now if only Maria would hit something. Wow. Gus's axe attack timed perfectly with the music. That was wonderful. Oh, Maria, you're never going to level up your... Ooh, Ferian's skill and HP increased. Oh, Maria's bow still increases. Okay. That's good. Wonder. Does that mean she doesn't necessarily have to use it? I don't know. I'm going to switch back and forth here. This bow is crap. Maybe once I have, maybe I'll get a quiver or something at some point. Okay, you didn't have anything to tell me that was useful. There's nobody over this way. I can't talk to you. Well, I can talk to you, but you don't tell me anything. Is there anybody here that, oh, go away. There's nobody here that I can talk to And by talk to, I mean using my keywords, my memorized keywords. Oh, maybe I should have healed at the inn. 